Welcome to Trigger News. I am Nolan Akers and I am your anchor today. Today we'll be talking about deforestation, pollution, and how it affects the inhabitants around it. Our sponsor today is absolutely nobody, because who wants to sponsor a bunch of kids doing absolutely nothing with their lives? Before we get to that though, we're going to go to the weather. It's pretty good. Here's Isaac with deforestation. Hi. Welcome to Tree Wars, Man vs. Nature. I am here with Isaac, awesome self. And we are obviously in the forest. This is a very wild forest. Anyways, every single day there's a total of 42 million trees chopped down. And a total of 7 billion trees per year cut down. If you can't tell, that's kind of a lot. So we need to do something about that. Because I think that's a big issue. And every single time we chop down a tree, we're taking away about, like, you know, tons of animals, wild, like, food, water, home. Imagine living on the street with no food, no water, no home. That would just straight up suck. Can you tell what I mean? Yes. Thank you for saying yes. Anyways, with that, we are basically screwing other animals over. Yeah. That's kind of not good. 90% of the monarch butterfly population is decreasing due to man-made chemicals. If you can't tell, we're all screwed because if without the United States having a monarch butterfly, what are we useful for? Because monarch butterflies are awesome. Thank you, Isaac, for that very informational subject. Up next is a small clip from the new HBO series, In the Wild with Nate Hartley, that he specifically made for this new station right here. Take a look. Hello and welcome to Into the Wild with Nate Hartley. We are in the middle of a water runoff field, as you can see. Yeah. It is very nice. It looks like absolute garbage, though. But with water, water comes here all the time. People come in here and just litter like crazy. 80% of ocean pollution comes from stuff like this that came straight out of the desert. I mean, even look at this. I just lifted a rock up and found a can. 80%. And in the northwest alone, there's like 2.1 million pounds of ocean water. That's not epic, all right? See, this is supposed to help the trash not flow through. But as you can see, it's not working very well. As we go out over here and into the wild, we find more and more garbage littered among everything. And I didn't just place this here for TV. This is all here where we found it. Right. See, if you go over here, see, even, even Taco Bell is littering. See? <laughs> this trash. Let's place it back. We'll pick it up later. No, I won't. 2.1 million pounds. And over here, you see about one of those pounds. And these systems aren't working. As you can see, the one over there. It is absolutely demolished. Isn't that just a house? And thank you for coming into the wild with Nate Hartley. This is Nate signing off. <laughs> Hello, and welcome back to Into the Wild with Nate Hartley. For today, we're not so much in the wild. We're standing right here next to this light pole. This light pole. Can you explain to me what this light pole is for? That's right, it causes light pollution. And you see, light pollution takes form in many forms. There's the classic poles that have lights on top of them, otherwise known as a light pole. We also have, if we walk on over here, headlights. Not good. See, at night, if we didn't have so many of these things wandering around, then we could see way up into the sky at night and see all the tiny little stars in all their form of glory. And the one way to get rid of these alls is to put it absolutely decimating every single one of these. No, I'm just kidding. We just take them down, bro. You can see the scar right now. And that's basically it. Also, if we go back to my last segment. Stupid lights. What the heck is this? We just cut there. Incredible. Well, I guess not incredible. It's kind of disgusting how much the human race pollutes the environment. But anyways. Here's a small new segment that we like to call Joke of the Day. Hopefully it's better than yesterday's.
Oh, sorry, I just got a call in saying that there was none yesterday. So, that kind of explains why it's new. Take Hello, away, today's joking segment, we have Nate Hartley from Into the Wild. Nate Hartley. Hello. Would you like to hear a joke today? No. Too bad. Did you hear about Joe? Who the frick is Joe? Joe Mama. That joke was complete other ass. Hopefully Nate's alright. Uh, someone might want to go down there and detain Isaac, but other than that, I hope you had fun with this new educational program, uh, talking about deforestation, pollution, and uh, why we suck as the human race. Until tomorrow, I'm Nolan Akers. See ya.